Hello, welcome to another time of lecture in um, catfish business. I'll be quick about this. I'll go straight to the point. The issue at hand now is that many farmers are closing. Many farmers are packing up. Many farms are out of business. Reason is because the feed price is escalating every day. It is increasing every day. So, we are preferring solutions now to be able to stay in the business. And that is why I come to you. And one of the things I want to talk about today is to diversify. The catfish business is a chain. It has various arms. You have the area, you have the grow out area where you, you rear fishes. You have the um, area where you hatch fishes, the hatchery. You have the area where you dry fishes, you know, smoked fishes. Now, these three areas, you can diversify in the chain and do three of them, or you do two of them. This is not the time where we stay in one at all, okay? You can do one, or you can pause what you are doing now. If it is too hard for you to do grow out, pause grow out and go into hatchery. Learn about it and then start it. It's very easy. Use one male and two female, or one male and one female, and then you have that. You learn about how to look after the fries and all that. And until they get to finger links and you sell after one month. Okay? Or you can do a little bit of hatchery and a little bit of grow out. Or you do a little bit of hatchery, a little bit of grow out, and a little bit of drying the fishes and selling them, selling them out to the cons uh, consumers. Now, because of the, econ the harsh economy we have globally today, it's affecting every business. So the solution to survive now is to diversify. Now, not only to do the entire chain of the catfish business, but you can also go out of catfish business and do some other business, okay? Now, one business alone cannot keep a businessman or a businesswoman. You need at least three streams of income. Now, that is to say you have to do at least three small, small businesses. It must not be just catfish business. Because if it, you have just one business, your demand will destroy the business because you will, you will, you will, you will, put so much demand on the profit you make until you begin to eat your capital now but if you have about three businesses or four businesses you can pay school fees with one business you can buy fuel for your car with one business you can pay house rent with one business so on and so forth so at the end of the day you are not putting too much demand on any business but you see in nigeria we have um, some type of mentality that sets us back this mentality of i am called to do one thing or i am destined to do one thing it makes us not to do so many things. I do so many things. In fact, somebody called me out one day. He said, Oga, which one are you doing? Stop confusing us. Are you a fish farmer? Are you a singer? Are you a poet? Are you a music director? Are you this? Are you that? Are you this? Tell us so that we know which one to follow. You can imagine that kind of mentality. No. You can do anything you set your mind to do. For now, let us be able to follow the right solutions to able to survive in this business you can do start some other business small now so that it can help your catfish business okay do not say you are destined or called to do one thing nobody's called to do one thing nobody's destined to do anything anything you put your heart to do you survive and succeed in it okay this is as much as i can take today um, i will meet you some other time when i come with short videos my name is mr greg do not forget to subscribe to my youtube channel so that when things like this come, you'll be the first to get it. Bye for now.